You hear about protests, shootings, civil unrest. That sounds like a reality that we've seen played out on the, in the news. But really, what I'm talking about this time is a high drama. This is a movie, a thriller that's coming out. It's called New Order, and it's packing all of that stuff in. Take a look at this. ¿Cuánto te mamá? 35. Está bien, ¿no? Sí. El problema es que por lo menos para hoy me faltan 150. ¿Y de dónde los vas a sacar? Yo tengo 50, pero igual me va a faltar más de la mitad. Mil, dos mil, tres mil, quinientos. Yeah, that's just a sneak peek there. The award-winning award -winning film, it portrays a tough look at class division in Mexico. And our next guest is here to tell us all about it. With us now is Diego Bonetta. Diego, so great to have you with us. And not only are you the star of this show, you are this movie, you also were the executive producer. And I understand the role that you uh, played actually was written for you specifically. How did that come about? Yes. Hi, Amy. Hi, TJ. It's great to uh, be here with you guys. Um, well, Michelle Franco, who wrote and directed this this movie, who's a Mexican filmmaker, uh, who's just amazing, and I've 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 admired for many years, called me and said, "Listen, Diego, I uh, wrote this script. Uh, I wrote this this part for you. I'd love for you to check it out and tell me what you think." and I read the script and, you know, it's it was one of the, you know, most intense scripts I've ever read. Mm. Um, we shot it pre pandemic uh, 2019. We shot it and uh, it's just crazy to see how uh, it's become more and more and more timely. So uh, he just, you know, told me about this movie. I read the part read the script and i was like listen michelle it'd be i'd be honored to be you know to, to 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 do this with you and he also invited me to produce this with him which was an even bigger honor uh and um you know we went to to venice this past year to the venice film film festival the movie won the jury prize which was amazing and uh it's kind of crazy how as as months go by the movie becomes more and more relevant throughout the world, which is kind of scary. So, Diego, the, the film, congratulations on the awards and the attention that the movie is getting, but you all kind of promote it. It's, it's called a necessary fiction for a potential reality, and you've kind of touched on how intense it is and how it's become more relevant. What, what do you mean how it's become more relevant with the time since you all have even shot it? Yes. Well, that's that's a great question, TJ. It's it's a movie that mainly talks about polarization uh, in Mexico, right? Uh, and it's a dystopian movie, um, but it's very grounded and it's and it's and it's and it's very raw. And the way Michelle makes movies, you know, he Michelle likes to make you feel uncomfortable, right? Um, and the reason why it's become more and more relevant, it's, you know, we were, we were at the Venice Film Festival almost a year ago, and um, we also won the uh, student prize because they all said that this film was like a warning to them about, you know, what, what, what happens when there's a lack of empathy, when there's no dialogue. And, you know, since then, you know, COVID happened. And uh, I think that... Um, made polarization worse throughout the world you know and even before that you had you know the yellow vests in paris what was going on in chile today what's going on in colombia what happened at you know capitol hill in the u.s uh so that's 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 why i feel this movie um could not be more relevant because it's happening throughout the world even though this movie takes place in mexico it's a it's a it's a universal theme that you see happening all over the world right now. and so many lessons watching it play out there on that film diego thank you so much for being with us it was our honor to have you here on the show we want to let everyone know you can see new order in theaters everywhere diego Benetta, thank you for being with us today thank you amy
It's a pleasure being with you guys. Have a great afternoon. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.